Hello and welcome back in our new lecture. In this lecture, we will learn how to make your plot more professional and beautiful to look. So this is the most interesting part. That is the reason why people use origin. So uh, let's start. So you have the plot. So you have some kind of a data and you plot it. You get some graph with, you know, uh, untidy data and name and everything. So how to start editing? First of all, let's do one thing. Let's uh, go to line and ticks. Okay. And then go to left. And here, what you can do is instead of out, click on in and then click apply. You see all the major ticks are lined on the inner side. Similarly, you can do that for minor ticks also. Select in and click apply. You can do the same for the bottom. So you go to the major ticks, click on in. You go to the minor ticks, click on in and then click apply and press OK. Now click on the double click on the data. And here what you can do is you can show in scientific notation right and click apply similarly on the left you can also select scientific notation and click apply then okay now the plot still looks quite decent than our previous and let us delete this because there is only one line we don't need that after this uh, we may want to draw a box in the graph Right? Because generally in journals and papers, you see there is a nice box with the data axis. To do the box, what you have to do is go to ticks and lines, lines and ticks. Click on top. So there are four sides, bottom, top, left and right. Click on top, click on show line and tick and then click apply. Similarly, go to right. Click on so line and ticks, click on apply. And you will see you will have this beautiful box which looks very professional and beautiful for your graph and click OK. Now at this point, this graph is ready to export. You can go to file and then you can click on export graph, click on open dialog and then uh, you can select as a PDF and you can select a file name select your location and then click on OK to save the PDF okay so that is that you can do that I want to show you mm. so what more can we do now uh, if you click on the axis you see we have the Y axis right so here there are many other settings in case you are interested to change. For example, if you go to left, if you go to right, that means this side. Here you can select the minor ticks to outside. So you see the minor ticks are now on the outer side. Uh, suppose you are doing some kind of a special curve where you need to show the major and minor ticks on the different side you all can do that also and uh, suppose that you want to change the color to a different color you can do that too suppose you want to match the color of the dot to some of the axis you can do that so this is just to show you uh, nothing else and then you can press ok right uh, so just uh, to show you you can always full screen screen your graph and have a better look right and then to close it you just click on this and it will get smaller so this is how you set up your 2d plot in origin so thank you for watching and in our next lecture we will learn how to plot 3d graphs in origin that will be fun so thank you for watching and we'll be back in our next lecture